Good morning, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan with your morning digital news brief for Monday, August 24th. Police are searching for a woman who assaulted a churchgoer inside of the Cathedral Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul during Sunday Mass. Live stream video shows the moment the woman punched the lector in the face. The victim is expected to be okay. The Archdiocese says it will hold a meeting later today to address security at the Basilica. A shakeup at the White House. Kellyanne Conway says she's leaving at the end of the month. Conway made the surprise announcement last night, saying she needs to focus on her family. The South Jersey native was President Trump's campaign manager during the 2016 presidential race. She then became a senior counselor to the president. The Republican National Convention kicks off tonight in Charlotte, North Carolina. The four night event is expected to focus heavily on President Trump's accomplishments and lay out his vision for the second term. Meanwhile, a CBS News battleground tracker poll shows Joe Biden maintaining a lead among voters nationwide. Now let's get a check of the weather with Larissa. Hot and humid start to the week, Jim. We're going to continue here with high heat and humidity. And later today, it's going to feel more like 95 degrees as we factor in the humidity versus 90, the true temperature on this morning. Monday. Hit or miss thunderstorms also not out of the question. Some of them can pack a punch leading to heavy rain out there, but we're actually going to see the threat for severe weather as we head towards tomorrow. Take a look at future weather. It shows some spotty activity here throughout the afternoon and evening hours, but the real threat once again arrives on Tuesday where we are anticipating strong to severe storms to unfold as we approach Tuesday afternoon and evening. The primary impact being strong damaging wind gust tomorrow 90 degree weather once again by Wednesday though behind this frontal boundary we are drying out and we're also cooling off 85 degrees here for Wednesday temperatures do jump again as we head towards Thursday and then we're looking at the possibility for rain some of it heavy to end the work week Jim Thank you very much, Larissa. And you can always get Larissa's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for the Morning Digital Brief. I'm Jim Donovan. Make it a great day.